Hello? Hello? Anybody out there? <gasps> You're awake! Oh, hi. I'm new here. Hi! I'm Major. I'm kind of a big deal at the rescue center. Should I have dressed up? <laughs> what, because of my tie? No, but today is a special day. My skunk friends are going back to the wild. The wild? I think I was just there. You were. I'm a little nervous. You are going to love it here. Come on, I'll show you. We were just about to do our morning rounds. Right, Mom? Mom? <laughs> Looks like she got started without me. Mom helps animals who are sick or hurt. And I help her. You want me to get the feeding tube? Oh, no. You got it. Uh, forgot my gloves. <laughs> <laughs> That's ticklish. I'm uh, going to sit this one out. Some of us need extra care, so the rescue center becomes our forever home. But if an animal gets all the way better and is ready for the wild, we help them go back, just like today. Major, can you help me find the skunk babies? Are you for serious? <laughs> That's the biggest job on release day! I, I promise, with all my heart, I will not let you down. Okay, little buddy, you sit tight. You comfy in there? Yeah, though I'm pretty sure I'm going in circles. Did you hear what Mom said, Pepperoni? <laughs> she put me in charge of getting the skunks ready for the wild. I don't think that's what she said. I'm in charge. Ha <laughs> ha! Do you know how to help our friends go back to the wild? Yes. Well, no, but yeah, I'll figure it out. Nothing a groundhog like me couldn't handle on my own. Oh, skunk babies, where are you? The skunk babies came here to the Second Chances Wildlife Center after they were found alone in a shed with no one to take care of them. They were so scared at first. This place was strange and new to them, but once they realized we were here to help, they started to feel like this place was a home, even if it was temporary. The skunk babies are... Ah, not babies anymore, Major. Yeah, we heard we're going back to the wild today. Mm-hmm. And it's my job to make sure you're ready. Not really not. <laughs> Pepperoni. <laughs> We've been trying to get ready, practicing looking for food, and working on our spraying. Acha! And making sure there's always toilet paper in the bathroom. That one I don't think will be necessary in the wild. But we don't know if we're ready for the real wild yet. I have an idea. What about this video I found called Going Back to the Wild for Skunks? Let's check it out. So you're ready for the wild, are you? Of course you are. Gosh, this is great, isn't it? Forget indoor blankets. You're about to get cozy in a pile of crunchy leaves. Oh, no. Time to trade in your fancy toys for sticks and rocks. Hmm, probably wouldn't focus on that. Yes, the wild is just full of surprises. Speaking of surprises, when it gets dark, you'll hear scary noises. Wait, what? <laughs> what was that noise? We'll never know. How do you turn this thing off? The great outdoors awaits. Now get out there, you big fluffy-tailed skunks, and be wild. Well, that looks fun, doesn't it? No. We're scared, Major. We don't want to leave home. What was that noise? No, no, that was just a bad video. Well, be right back. No, 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 don't, don't say that. You're ready. I need you to be ready. And I've lost them. Skunk babies, where are you? Blackjack, oh, I need your help. <laughs> really? Usually I just make things worse. What? No, it's release day, and the skunk babies are, uh, through no fault of mine, completely, accidentally missing. It's his fault. Did you look in the living room? Yes. Then I'm out of ideas. What am I going to do? They were supposed to go back to the wild, right? So, maybe that's where they went. A problem solved. You think so? But they seem so nervous. No, 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 no. They'll be just fine. I just hope they watch out for stuff they can get stuck in. Stuck? Yeah. I've heard of raccoons getting stuck on chimneys, or in a trash can, or in a school, where they made them learn to read. Is that right? Oh, maybe I got that mixed up. Oh, trash cans, though. Definitely trash cans for sure. Yeah. Uh. Did I make it worse? Y yes. <laughs> 
very much so. Woo! Unbroken record. <laughs> okay, bye, Major. What am I gonna do? The skunk babies could be stuck in a trash can on the chimney of a school. If Mom finds out I scared the skunks, she'll never trust me again. Hey, Turbo! I need your help. Coming. Oh, dear. Uh, I'm gonna check for the skunks in the yard while I'm waiting. Rollins! Did the skunk babies come through there? Nope, there's nothing going on out here. Except that I did figure out that this isn't a real hamburger. Well, folks in the house are gonna be shocked to hear that. Try inside. If your buddies went through here, I'd find them. All I've seen is this hamburger. Thanks, Rollins! Inside, huh? Oh, but I'm running out of time. Mom could be ready to release them any second. Hey, Major. What's up? Horny! I need your help with something. Got it. Wait! You don't know what it is yet. Right. I need you to keep Mom busy while I find the skunk babies. No problem. You're gonna get her to give, give you me a bath. bath. Yes. Whew! You're a lifesaver. No. I'm Arnie. Arnie the Armadillo. First thing you need to know about me. I love baths. I love to splish, splash, roll around, and sing like there's no tomorrow. Oh, rub-a-dub-dub, -dub, Arnie's in the tub. It was my bath time. Oh, I'd take a million a day if I could. But I only get baths when my mom thinks I'm dirty. And that there is the secret sauce, my friends. If I can find a way to get dirty. Arnie, get out of the garbage. She has to give me a bath. Oh no, I've fallen into this box of dusty macaroni looking things. Bath time. Clumsy me, I've run into this plant pot. Bath time. Oh no, I've fallen in this bowl of... Oh, it's just water. Nevertheless, bath time. We're getting all soapy and we're taking a bath. Skunk babies, where are you? Please come out. Where's the one place I haven't looked? Major, what are you doing in the Major, toilet? So bad. Let's get out. We're done. Oh, hey. Mom, I'm so glad you found me. So, uh, I don't have the skunk babies quite yet, but I will have them, and, and, and when you do, uh, and when I do, you, you will see them, and they'll be ready. Okay, meet you downstairs, bye. Skunk babies, is that you? Hey, JB, listen, I'm in big trouble, big time, and I can't find the skunk babies anywhere, and, and I'm in charge of bringing them back to the wild. I know what we should do. Build a dam. I'm sure it'll be lovely, but nobody needs a dam right now. Really? Really? Yeah, I know. I think it could help. Why is this always your first idea? Because, Major, look, you never know when there's going to be an indoor flood or baby skunks on the loose. And this house is full of stuff to build a dam. Shoes, books and magazines, blankets, and there are sticks all over the place. Sports sticks, cleaning sticks, drawing sticks. What? <laughs> I mean, we don't need a dam in the house. Oh, you sound just like mom and everyone else. Oh, what's the use? Mom really only told me to just find the skunk babies and I messed that up. He admitted it. See, they weren't prepared. I was trying to prepare them. They got to figure that out on their own. Well, that's what happened to me. When mom rescued me, I couldn't go back to the wild because I needed special care. So mom built me my own beaver pond outside. But when the time came, I wasn't prepared. I needed time to figure out the perfect angle for stick placement and the optimal entry point for maximizing water flow. I mean, the planning alone would have taken a year. But one day I realized I was prepared. I have been preparing this whole time. These sticks are just like these sticks. And this water is just like this water. By the time I gave it another try, I was an old pro. So you're saying the skunks are prepared? Of course they are. They're big. They've learned all they can here. 
and they're ready to go. The only thing missing is... A damn! Oh, <sighs> skunk babies! Oh, sorry, skunks? Big skunks? Listen, I know you're scared to go back to the wild, but the wild is a wonderful place. The forest is full of surprises, but that's a good thing. Think of all the new animals you'll meet, like, like a deer. They're like a groundhog, but, but real stretched out with hard feet and pointy sticks on their head. We have to stay here because we still need mom's help, but you've learned everything you can. It's time to go to the wild where you can make a new home for yourselves. Maybe we could just go next year. I know you don't think you're prepared, but you are. Yeah! You got this! We'll miss you! You're not going anywhere! No! No damn! Remember? Being ready isn't something that just happens. I don't know. This all smells different. You just have to believe you can take that first step into the unknown. I'm glad we're out here together. Me too. If you give it a try, you just might find... Whoa! I feel my skunk instincts kicking in. Who wants to get sprayed? You had it in you all along. You can see so far out here, and it smells like... Fox! No. Beetles! This is where we belong! Bye, Major! Thanks for everything! We'll miss you! Whew, I almost messed that up. But then, I didn't. Hey, Major! I know what you're gonna say, Pepperoni. Good job! That is not what I thought you were gonna say. At all. Major, you really helped them feel ready to go. Oh, it was all them. From now on, you are my release day captain. <laughs> yes! Hey, where's Arnie? Bye. Bath time! I'm the luckiest groundhog in the world. Who else gets to wake up every day surrounded by friends and family? In a home where we're all helping each other get better. And always looking out for the next animal who might need our help. Possums! <laughs> wow, you're even bigger than you were this morning. Do you think I'm ready to go back to the wild? <laughs> oh, not yet. But you'll know when it's time. I'm here. What did you need? Oh, we, uh, we solved it already. Okay. Dodo Kids. Help the kittens find the subscribe button.